State police here in Westmoreland County say this investigation is still active at the Huntington Inn Motel, where they have confirmed there was a shooting this afternoon, but they're not releasing a lot of details. What we know at this time is that investigators, they're still working the scene and the coroner's office has been called in. All police now are confirming is that a shooting occurred, but we don't know if the shooter fired at law enforcement or someone else. In the meantime, we have eyewitnesses who describe what they saw and heard at the time. We heard uh, the sound of what might be flashbangs or gas grenades. So we stepped outside. Um, that seemed to be the beginning of the incident. Um, from there, we saw the officers running around, weapons drawn. But it appeared that the suspect had ran around back into the fields near uh, next door. You saw someone run? We did see someone run, yes. And uh, did this person fire a weapon? Was he carrying a weapon? It was unclear to tell, but it sounded like, based off the commands that police were giving, he did have a weapon. The state police are very limited with the information that they can give. They do say that the general public was not in danger of the shooting that took place here at the motel. However, they do say that they're still investigating as to whether or not they have a suspect in addition to the person who was found dead, knowing that the coroner's office has been called to the scene. More now from another eyewitness who saw and heard some of the activity as it happened this afternoon. There was a lot of commotion going on down there. Uh, the state police helicopter was going around up on the top, which concerned me if there was another person or they were looking for other people that left the hotel. State police say they will release more information as it becomes available with this investigation. Reporting from Route 30 in Westmoreland County, Sheldon Ingram, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.